Hello! In this part of the course, I'd like to focus on our main problem of decision making under uncertainty. So far, we have discussed several laws of probability as well as our intuitions when it comes to dealing with randomness, our cognitive biases, and so on. Our main goal throughout all this has been to develop a more probabilistic way of thinking. We do not want to necessarily seek certainty, but rather to understand and appreciate the randomness and uncertainty in life. To do this, we want to increase the probability of success in such situations, simply because achieving certainty is impossible. Also, seeking too much certainty means that we are not taking enough risk and we will end up losing a lot of opportunities. Here, I would like to make two points. Firstly, Appreciating randomness does not mean that you are indecisive or have a lack of determination or self-confidence. I would even argue that the opposite is true. By appreciating randomness, you understand, accept, and take advantage of uncertainties. You understand the differences between rational decision-making and the best outcomes. You know that because of randomness, the most rational decisions might not always result in the best outcome. However, in the long run, rational decision making will increase your success probability significantly. Another important point is in communicating uncertainty. Unless you have taken a course like this or learned about probabilistic thinking somehow, the odds are that you intuitively would like to have certainty. This is why politicians try to provide messages of certainty and confidence when they are campaigning. Of course, the advertised certainty is usually an illusion, but people react positively to it. In this way, communicating uncertainty is a bit of a tricky art. We need to communicate it in an effective way without implying a lack of confidence or determination. Both of these issues are extremely important as we begin to consider the main topic of decision making under uncertainty. As we continue, these issues will become clearer and clearer as we discuss specific strategies and ideas regarding decision making. Thank you for watching.